Need to put some cloth to pad it tomorrow. Cleft! I think not thief! Help! Guard! فلتصحبك السلامة في رحلتك باسم I knew it was you You are not the only one with eyes that see afar So, Tabed You have filled the streets with eyes and spies Such is the life of a Rafiq Without my knowledge, huh? where would we be? Knowledge is a tool, a weapon It can be used for good or ill and the Order is using it for ill indeed. What have you learned? Rot runs deep through the House of Wisdom. They are using some ancient book, hoping to build a wicked device. Mm. I have heard rumors of this blasphemous contraption. They call it their great work. The Order is experimenting on people. Lethally. I have stopped them for now. But someone called El Rabisu is running things at the House of Wisdom. Hmm. Any idea about who this Rabisu character could be? I have my suspicions about the great scholar, Fazil Fahim. That fragile old man? The clues I have gathered tell me so. Hmm. It could be. The House of Wisdom will be hosting a great symposium soon. An informal gathering of scholars. A lecture, refreshments, chatter. Even the great Arib will attend. Go! Spy out this puzzle with care. But do not throw your blade at the symposium. We don't want to show our hand just yet. Hmm. But if Fazil is guilty and alone, then like a viper, strike! But you must be sure. Before I act, I will be sure.
لم يكن ملكهم سكيرا احمق لحكمت لي العام الماضي رأيت أن أواصل الموضية هذه المرة أن أرى المحطة وكان يصر على أن فتياته طازجة بإمبرك أيضا هذا المحطة يجب أن يكون هنا بغداد برايتست يشارك أهل الوزن Pardon me. I am looking for the great scholar's lecture. Fazal Fahim's lecture about the antediluvian antecedents of humanity will begin soon. In the meantime, please enjoy our ample stock of exquisite delicacies and tasty refreshments. Where is Arib al Ma'munia, the poet? Where is Arib? I hope to catch a whiff of her magnificent aura. So rare to see her outside of the round city. The beloved is in the garden, ruminating upon the perfection of nature. Oh, to be a flower held in her discerning hands, inspiring such languid verse. She must be relieved to be free of her wealthy patrons for a change. Oh, perhaps she leads an exciting secret double life, slipping out of the palaces to find inspiration in common life. <laughs> I doubt it. The translator? Hunayn, you should not be back so soon. I know. I'm still nervous, but I couldn't stay away from my books. I guess we must always do our duty. Wada'an. <laughs> I told you I'd see you around. Indeed. And what brings you back? I want to show you something. This house of wisdom boards collect the wildest trinkets and gadgets. I have been here before, Nihal. This is Ahmed ibn Musa's office. Have you been sneaking in there? It gives me a tingle down my spine. Like I'm nearing a cosmic secret. You read too much about magicians and lost cities buried beneath the dunes. You don't read enough. Perhaps there are other worlds, other people, out among the stars. Nonsense. Ahmed and his brothers are capable of designing some fantastic devices. Not all of his ideas are that practical, I'm afraid. Don't be so smug. 
The world is full of wonders. Poet a bit loves, whose work keeps turning up in unexpected places. Spirit, yes? Symmetry of sky and sea, but only in thine eye do these two planes meet. You have read my work. And who might you be? A lover of poetry, nothing more. And of order. Or should I say, chaos. I know only one living poet who loves chaos that much. Ali ibn Muhammad. Are you a fan of his pedestrian work? The rivalry between you two is legendary. It enhances the craft. I cannot choose. You are most diplomatic. But I would rather seek inspiration among these lovely blooms. Good day. remind you of your nightmares? No. More like something from the Bimaristan. Or a training chart of the Hidden Ones. Ah, uh, yes. The swift ways to kill silently. Death in seconds. seen this one before. Is this what you wanted to show me? Yes. It reminded me of that object we found at the palace. What is it? A drawing from an ancient book. There is something you are not telling me. You do not want to know what happens behind closed doors. Why? Because you do not know either? Because, as Dirwish says, sometimes it is better not to know the truth behind the things we must do. The truth, Basim, is that everything is here in front of you. But you refuse to look at it. This is about you. It has always been about you, ever since that night. I took an oath, Nihal. To leave my old life behind and walk this path of shadows. And maybe someday you will find the light. But until then, I will walk behind you every step of the way to remind you not to forget who you are. Is that a threat? I do not know. Thank you. 
That astronomer might be one of them. Sayyidi, I am honored to make your acquaintance. Good to see more young people enjoying the House of Wisdom. Do you think the great scholar will give a good lecture? Do not waste time listening to his nonsense. I have written many more edifying and practical books instead. On which topics? I have written extensively about sundials, astrolabs, stars and planets, and the circumference of the Earth. Fascinating, Sayyidi. I shall read more of your work soon. Wadaan. Sounds like the lecture is about to begin. I should return to the Kahreman. Pardon me. Is Fazel Fahim's lecture ready to begin? Indeed it is. Head inside, if you please. Welcome, one and all, to the House of Wisdom, center of learning in Baghdad, indeed, of the entire world. I am Fazil Fahim al Kimsa, first scholar of the House of Wisdom, wisest of the wise. Today, I will shock you with what may sound like outrageous blasphemies. <laughs> Do not fear, good people. Though I am old, my mind remains sharp as steel. Today, I speak of mysteries, of creatures from the antediluvian age. Do not the ancient prophets tell us about giants from before the flood? who forsook Allah and worshipped false idols? Is it not possible these giants built marvels, works of wondrous power, now lost to us? Zahra and Hassan are both dead, slain by an assassin's blade. They are dead. Sayidi, I urge you to hide until it's safe. Uh, uh, apologies, people, but our lecture has concluded. Please. Feel free to explore the House of Wisdom's many fine chambers. You call yourself the Great Scholar, Fazil. You who burn books and hope the smoke will hide your crimes. How many did you sacrifice in your search for knowledge? How many did you use, damage, and discard in the name of discovery? Now you hide within the House of Wisdom. The house you led astray. But I will find you. And I will exact justice for every soul you savaged for your great work. It is true. Fazil leads the order in Abbasia. I need to hunt him down. The old fraud spawns helmet to the high. How exciting. But do you think frightened the great scholar? The old fool must have imagined one of his antediluvian creatures. He's an absolute disgrace. But where did he run off to? There's rumors of hidden passages beneath the House of Wisdom. Maybe he hid down there. I have heard the rooftop gardener mention these places, yes. What a colorful detail to include in my verse. The scholar, by secret tunnels fled, chased by delusions of deities who want him dead. Pardon me, but I heard a rumor about a hidden basement beneath the House of Wisdom. A secret basement? You must be joking. No, not at all. Surely, such a large building must have basements and cellars to store books and inks. I am aware of no such location on these premises. 
Perhaps a little token of my appreciation will jog your memory. Most generous. <sighs> Murders, mayhem, and bonfires. It's time for me to depart the House of Wisdom. Father has a fine carpet shop in Samara. He always wanted me to take up the family trade. A wise choice. Now, about any hidden cellars. Oh, yes, uh, of course, forgive me. Now that you mention it, there is a basement hatch in the northwest courtyard. Thank you. Gatekeeper, let me pass. Those who came before are... What are you talking about? Those who came before are... Let me get back to you. I've lost Fossil's greatest work. Looks clear. I've lost I can use my weapons work. again if needed. What do you mean you lost the great scholar's masterwork? I'm sorry. I was distracted by the presence of the famous poet Arib. Forget the poet! We better find Fazl's book or we're both dead. Sounds like part of a passphrase. I can use my weapons again if needed. out of place wedged behind a desk like that. A history of the great scholar and his magnificent reforms of the House of Wisdom by Fazl Fahim. Not sure if this is the correct volume.
That's odd. I better get back. What was that? Looks like somebody left a book in the stairwell. Better not use my weapons here. The folly of poetry by Fazil Fahim. Does not sound too romantic, to be honest. This letter mentions a private reading balcony. Might be where the reader has taken the book.
What? Show me everything. Keep to the roof, I say. Plenty of work to do up here. Safe to avoid dark. This place coming too. And all the screams from the basement. Better not use my weapons here. What do you see, Enkidu? Did I ever tell you about the time the Amir was mad at the same If you ask me, half the court. <laughs> This key could be What's useful. This place coming to mm. those screams from the basement. Mm. Makes my stomach cold. Such pain. I better not use my weapons here.
An impressive volume, written by Fazil Fahim. Could be his masterwork. Its title is, Those who came before are those who shall return. This has to be it. <clears throat> I better not use my weapons here. Gatekeeper, those who came before are... ...are those who shall return. Correct! You may proceed! Clear. I can use my weapons again if needed. We'll know your eyeballs, Smith.
There is a deep wrongness here. A reek of rot and iron. Those robes might help me get closer to Fazil. What have they done to these people? Poor guy will not need this anymore. This should help me blend in. You are new, aren't you? I don't recognize you. They promised you gold when you volunteered, yes? No matter. What you are about to behold surpasses all worldly riches. Don't be afraid. Are you afraid? This is my great work. I call it Arua. It will take you on a journey to another realm. Why did the first ones leave this world behind, filled with fools, I wonder, and make so few of me? We call this the House of Wisdom, but its foundations are unsound. For beneath the House of Wisdom lies the Dungeon of Ignorance, and upon such dark secrets we build our philosophies. Science is the noblest purpose. Knowledge is the greatest power. No. No? Then what? Maybe here where lies absolute knowledge. It, it is not how I remember it. Behind the doors, it looked brighter. But in the end, all we see is darkness.
scholar's notes. He believes in these ancient beings, the masters of memory. No question about it. Fazil was neck deep in the order. <laughs> 